Hey guys, Max Gear here again with another video for you guys, and today I told you guys I would be covering the raid, so less than a minute now till the raid starts, so let's get ready for that, start attacking, see what I can do, I believe I'm going to start hitting level 3s now, but let's check, we'll double check right now, let's see though, but, um, you guys ready for this, that's the question, I'm pretty ready right now, but let's see what I can do. Uh, epic boss, alright. Sorry, guys. Let's get into this. 15 seconds. Let's do this. Are you guys starting on the dot just like me, or are you guys going to wait? Either way, this video is not going to be uploaded right away. I told you guys. I will attack right now, get some footage for you guys, and then later on record while I'm out doing stuff. And then I will commentate on that later. So for the time being... If, if this loads, I, I guess it's not going to load. Let me see if I can do it on my second account. Oh, wait, there we go. Never mind. All right, confirm. And then I will scout to level three for myself and see what happens because I have a feeling I'm going to be able to do level threes now for this raid at least because of my team comp. So we're going to run this guy, this guy, and this guy. My earth pet. Oh, I just need, if I can get to stage 200 of the epic boss this week, guys, I can get that tier 4 three-star earth pet, if I can, but I don't think I can, so we'll see. Oh, I didn't run the best lineup, actually. I should have changed my lineup. Let's see what I do, though, guys. Come on. If I do more than 150,000, I know it's a good thing that I'm hitting level 3s, but if I don't, uh, I sadly still have to hit level 2s, but I think I should be, but let's see, let's see, don't quote me on that, I'm still not good like all you other pay-to-play players, people always picking on me, <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, they don't pick on me, but a lot of people always tell me their damage they're doing, and obviously I can't do that, I pretty much earned everything myself, so only the ring and amulets, that's the only thing I've spent money on so far, other than that, everything else I've earned from saving up gems myself, and it's not easy, but everybody can do it. Free-to-play players, you guys can do it. Like I said, ring and amulets are the only thing that are going to make a difference. But to get the sets, yeah, you have to probably spend money to get that. But to get Shadowforge ring and amulets themselves, no, you guys don't have to spend money. Trust me. I got in. I have gotten so many already. I'm going to get the ones in this raid. And, I mean, as long as you get Shadowforge ring and amulets, you can get higher stun chance on your armors. It's just you're not going to get the extra health and things like that but you are gonna get that that um stun chance though which is amazing so yeah two hundred thirty five thousand awesome way better than i've ever done in the past honestly <laughs> highest i think i've ever gotten was like 170k i think that was it now i'm passing 200k so it's great i'm gonna be able to two energy a level three if i have that tier four pet though oh i'd probably be soloing this level three boss like one energying it but Oh well, let's see what happens now. Let's keep hitting the, let's hit the other one. I'm using my second account, so if you guys hear clicking, I am attacking on my second account just to see how much I do. I'm doing about 60k on my second account. Oh, I forgot to change the lineup too. What am I thinking? Been hitting this whole time without <laughs> my lineup being changed. GG. So I guess that's a good thing I'm going to be hitting level 3s. My guild's going to be ranked a little higher than usual now. Usually we're like top 700, so top 1,000, but we're still probably going to be in there. I don't think we're going to get top 500, but at least now we're going to be getting a little higher just because I'm able to do more damage now. But that tier 4 pet, though, oh, I need it so badly. Uh, okay, let me change my lineup really quick because I have not been doing that, sadly. Sorry for all the clicking, guys, like I said. Cool, cool, cool. Put this armor and... Oh, wait, what am I doing? Team order. Got to change that pet. Let me actually just auto summon level threes. Auto scout. Ooh. I'm actually really happy I'm doing this much damage. So awesome. As long as I do more than 200k, like 200, at least I do 225k per attack, 
I will be two energy in a level three, so that's good. At least I'm doing that. Finally, I can fight level threes without having to waste a bunch of energy. Because before it used to be, if I did a level three, it was barely under the damage of the health of a level two boss. So I'd be doing like 120k to 150k. So it'd be about the same as a level two. But now it looks like I'm doing a lot more, so that's great. Totally happy about this raid because, you know, I have a bunch of armors to go against it. So that's great. What about you guys? What's your guys' lineup? I'm sure all you top players out there are using the Aqueous Bounty. I know a bunch of my guild, uh, my alliance mates, were posting pictures of the lineups. And, like, so many people have the Aqueous Bounty running. 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 And um, the new... Um, armor that had came out that water water one in the step chest uh, a couple of my guild mates and not guild mates alliance uh mates yeah i don't know if that's how you people in my alliance though they they got those and people are running those armors as well so it's pretty interesting but that's cool though i mean i'm fine with running this wish i could do better but it's not bad either 237k not bad not bad because i believe it's 400 50k right per level three think but let's see not bad i'm doing about 70k now on my second account because I switched up one of my armors i had the spirit air heroic because i mean it's just dragon forged i have i i don't work on this account at all i don't open chests to get better armors i don't farm armors things and that so all i had were like epics from years ago and so when I get the heroic armor, I just equip it, level it up, and pretty much use that. And as of right now, I only have three Dragonforge armors, two from heroic, one that I got way before that water and earth one that um I have on this main account. I have that one on my second account as well. And I don't think I got the Dragonforge from this time either. Or I did get the fire and air one, I believe. Not, not sure, but I, I believe I did. I can double check right now. But yeah, so my second account doing that. Let me see. Scout now. Okay, 400. So as long as I'm doing more than 200k, then that's that's fine with me. Not bad, not bad. So I'm probably going to be able to do this entire run through now, now that I'm doing level 3s for you guys. So that's awesome. Won't have to wait for that extra energy. Uh, is anybody else attacking in my guild? Let's see leaderboards nope just me and my second account so far uh, I can't really type on my computer because this thing always bugs out for some dang reason don't know why don't ask me why I really don't know but whatever <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sorry, I just never expected to do raid battles that took this long. And this isn't even a long time. Let's see, how long does it take me to fight one energy? A bit over a minute, probably a minute and a half. I don't think it goes to two minutes for one energy. But for the whole entire level three, probably takes about, I'd say like three minutes because of the delay. But let's see. Yeah, I was. Somebody told me that they were able to do level sixes. Somebody I was mes messaging, and they're like, "Oh, it takes like ten to fifteen minutes just to finish it." And I'm like, "Wow, I, I mean, I, I don't know. First off, like how you guys are doing that. I know I pretty much know how, but it's just like I can't imagine it for myself because I don't have that high of a stun chance. Like once I max these rings and amulets, it's gonna be great because the next like fire and air raid that comes by. Or anything just with air. So, like, water and air, most definitely. This armor is going to shred through that. Fire and earth is going to be taking a bit of damage, but it's going to have that stun chance, which is going to make it amazing. Uh, the earth one as well, but I'm not going to I'm gonna have to get some ringing amulets for that. But either way, I'm, those, they're all going to be stunning like crazy. So, that's great. Fire and air, because this, you know, then my fire one, fire and earth one doesn't take damage. Whereas, if it's a water and earth, I mean, water and air. Yeah, my last armor deals double damage, which is great because it's my strongest. But my fire and earth takes damage, and my water and earth takes damage. But in this one, only one armor takes damage, and it's dealing double damage, so that's great. The second armor doesn't take damage, like additional damage, so that's um, awesome as well. But once I get them fully maxed and have that extra stun chance, I think I'll probably be able to do level 4s. 
because the level threes will probably these level threes will probably just be getting stunned so much that I'll finish it off in one energy. And then also by then I'll have my tier four earth pet. So that's great. Yeah, I was trying to level up some pets to see if I can get another four star pet because I literally need one more four star pet because the ones that I get from this raid are going to give me seven and I need one more exactly. So if I can hit 200, the stage 200 on the raid, I mean the raid about the epic boss, I should be able to upgrade it, but I doubt I'm going to be able to do it by the time this raid's done. So that's going to suck a bit, but what can you do, right? Let me just message my guild really quick, guys. So sorry for the quick delay. Wait, did anybody attack it? No. Oh. Wait, why did I get this? Oh, okay. End of heroic. All right, guys. Well, something else is there, right? As well. So heroic did end already, guys. So if you guys got the armor, it's cool. If you guys didn't, then, well, sorry. There's always next week. I mean, not next week. Two weeks from now. But I don't know if they're gonna make it five days again or just one day. Um. Dang it, I can't type. Alright, just letting them know because I left that when I was attacking it on my second account. So, But, um, yeah, if you guys... I mean, hopefully they don't make it five days again because even though, like, if you're going for the Shadow Forged armor, yeah, you're probably fine because you can get the first one within, like, the first three, four days. It doesn't even matter. You can take all the time you want. You get it, and on the very last day, you get the last place that you need as long as you have all the other three. And you keep the uh, the pieces because it's Shadow Forge pieces. Like they can't get rid of it. So I said in my last video that you have a certain time. That that's that wasn't true. I apologize, guys. It's because I'm so used to the Dragon Forge pieces, like those star pieces that they get rid of them. Which all you say they did for me. I was farming a bit more, but I mean I didn't care. I don't really need the armor, the armor. Uh, but the Shadow Forge pieces you can take all the time you want out of those five days. But five days kind of seems short a lot, especially for the people getting like the newer people getting the armor. Like, when I was doing it, it wasn't that easy for me to get it, but it happened, so. Hopefully for any of you guys, if the five days was enough, then cool. If it wasn't, then hopefully they don't do this again, and you guys might have the extended time limit as well to get it, but we'll see, guys. We'll see, because I don't even know, honestly. But, let's wait and see. As of right now, let's just keep hitting this raid boss, because I am going to be uh, getting all the energy again. <laughs> Yep. It's the first time for me. But I was, oh my god, yesterday I was doing it. That's why I, I, there was a long message I wrote in the, the guild chat here. I was thinking about it. And for all of you free to play players out there, or those of you that don't pay too much, like me, I mean, I just spent it for the ring and amulets. If you don't spend it to get Shadow Forged armors and things like that, it's crazy to think that people can solo a level 6 raid boss that has 9 million health. I'll show you after I finish this one off. At least the last time I checked. I don't know. Maybe they dropped the health. I doubt it. But either way, if people are soloing that, which I know people can. Because if you have a crazy amount of stun chance, you have an, uh, a pet that heals you. You'll be stunning so often that you'll just be getting healed for the damage you take. And it'll take a long time, obviously, like I said, anywhere from 10 to 15 minutes, depending on how much damage you do. But you will be doing it. For those people that are doing that, one energy alone can get them 9 million damage. As long as it's consistent. And I'm sure most of these top hitters are consistent. Because like the Aqueous Bounty itself, everyone was saying it's so broken. Because the stats on that armor with Ring and Amulets Max and everything, it can hit up to 10k attack. And you still have like 6 or 7k defense. <sighs> Sorry guys, my keyboard's dirty. Plus the leech life or drain, whatever you want to call it. Those kind of attacks that give you extra health back. Just let me show you really quick. Oh, wait, wait, I was going to see the summon. So level 6. Yeah, level 6, 9 million. So if you solo that, the one energy you do is going to get you all the way to here. Uh, 1 million away from that. And that alone is all this energy. So that's 4, 8, 12, 17, plus the additional 4 you already started with, which is 21. And then you're gonna you're about to get another 12. So I already calculated all together. You're going to be getting 
33 energy in total if you started with four and you get all of this and if you're soloing level nines by the time you finish you'll be at about like 270 million so this entire milestone is done in the first day as long as you can solo it consistently so that's just crazy the fact that pay to play play pay to play players are doing that but i mean you're paying for it so i'm not gonna get mad it's just jealousy that sucks like us free to pay free to play players are barely doing level twos i'm barely doing a level three a couple other people probably doing level fours who have like max ring and amulets that got lucky and got them way before i did and have tier four pets already and things like that ones with leech life and stuff like that they're probably doing level fours but either way we're not getting most of us probably aren't getting the the milestone rewards like every single milestone reward whereas a pay-to-play player gets it like nothing without even spending the gems then when they spend the gems they get even more so I mean, the milestone themselves don't even matter, but they get Shadow Forged for finishing it, along with all the Shadow Forged armors they get from collecting all the pieces and things like that. And it's just, it's crazy to think that. But like I said, you guys are paying for it. I'm not going to say, oh, you know, this isn't fair. Don't let them do this. No, you guys, you guys paid for it. I understand. Like, it's just, it sucks for us, but what can you do? It's life, right? Like, if somebody in this world wanted to pay for something that I wanted, but I didn't have the money for it, I'm not going to get mad because, oh, they got it. They have the money for it. No, they shouldn't be allowed to have it. Like, no, you guys you guys are paying for it. Cool. But it's just crazy to think that, like, that's how big the gap difference is between free-to-play players and pay-to-play players. Like, my goodness. But that's the whole pay-to-play, right? That's why you guys are getting so far in this game because you guys pay for it. But that's cool, though. Congratulations, guys. But dang, man, that is just crazy. I didn't believe that. But now I do. So let's keep getting into this. Not bad, not bad. <laughs> it's not doing too bad. Two energy in a, a level three. Not bad. I'm actually doing pretty well. Doing about more than half of a level three and one energy. So if I had max ring and amulets, I don't even think with the tier four, I would like without the tier four, I'd be able to probably solo a level three. And then with tier four rock pet, I'd probably be doing more then a level four so i mean level three so i'd be attacking level fours and probably trying to do more than level three but who knows who knows i won't know till the day comes that i'm doing it so we'll have to see it's not bad not bad let's keep going let me check right now as soon as i finish this one i kind of want to see more or less the milestone that i'll be hitting for this part of the video and later on i'm, I'm gonna be showing you guys that some other time if I don't get the video footage today, because it's going to be when I hit those big energy milestones. If I don't get that video footage today, I will get that out for you guys tomorrow. So I will still upload this part and then get you the rest tomorrow. So let's see. Uh, for, I have six energy right now. And let's do it. So 400. I'm going to be 90,000 off. But I still that's for two energy. Then I still have four energy. So there's going to be two more. That's going to be 80, uh, 800,000. So yeah, I'm not going to be getting to this milestone just yet. So when I get that, I will add that footage for you guys. And then I probably will be skipping all this because that's going to be in between it. But when I get here, I'll get that footage for you guys as well. And like I said, I think I'm going to probably be getting this one. So that's pretty cool. I hope I do. Now let's keep attacking. Let me actually see how long has it been. It has no, it's been 18 minutes. Never mind. I was gonna say how long has it been? Do I have energy for my second account? But no, it's barely been. I still need 10 more minutes to get another energy on this account because every 25 minutes you get energy, guys. If you didn't know that, every 25 minutes is another energy. That's how it is for everything: for arena, for epic boss, for raid, everything. Every 25 minutes is the time it takes for your energy to regenerate by one. Just so you guys know. <laughs> it's not bad, not bad. It's pretty cool, pretty cool. How much do we have? Because my guild currently has... We're, my guild's currently level 56. So that's pretty cool. Uh, we're probably going to hit 60 after this raid and everything. Because a lot of times the old thing that always pops up is make 30 guild purchases. And when raids come by, we will just fly through that. So that's awesome. 
but uh, let's see uh, I am currently losing more members so that kind of sucks but it happens right um, people are becoming inactive out of all those people that join so what can you do but if any of you guys want to join my guild feel free to join most people that come don't stay I don't I don't want to sound rude but I don't have faithful people but it's mainly for the fact that my guild isn't maxed first off and then secondly I mean I don't have a lot of players I only have four other people aside from me that play this constantly and are actually there with me but they're not they don't even have Shadow Forge armor, so we're we're doing the best we can. And then I have two other accounts that I use as well. So total of eight eight active members that are active twenty four seven. Well not twenty four seven, but every day they are active, at least once every day. So only eight people. The rest are here and there. I do get new people that will join and stay active for a while, but some end up leaving, some end up becoming inactive, and what can you do? Once my guild's max, we'll see. Maybe I'll be getting more members, but as of right now, my guild, like I said, is currently level 56, so we still have, once I hit the level 57, we're still going to have, uh, what, 18 more levels to go till we're maxed completely in level, and then for the bonuses themselves, my guild still has how many? Uh, we're at 8 on 1, so we have 3, 6, 9, 12... 14 more uh, bonuses to go, and then my guild's completely maxed out on bonuses. So, pretty cool, pretty cool. But, I mean, from working it from the very starting point to this point, I'm happy. Because I did, I'm not even kidding. Like, I said this multiple times, and I don't know how many people believe me. But a lot of people do do this, so it's not a big thing to, like, it's not a big shocker. But I did start this guild from the very beginning, like since i created this account which has been years ago like i had my old phone that i created this account on probably like three years ago or more maybe and that's when i created the account but then i gave up on it like i said i got bored of the game left and then one day i ended up coming back and that was a year after i like had given up on it so it's been a while and that's when i created this guild and i created it from the start i had created other ones but i left those i gave them to people but then those guilds ended up becoming inactive so what can you do but either way i did create this guild and i worked it all the way up since then i have been in in it, uh, in it i have been in this guild every step of the way if i wasn't in it nobody else was in it but I did have like a second account in it so I could rejoin it whenever I needed to. So I've been in it the entire way. I've always built everything up and I've had my friends join me in different time intervals. But a lot of my friends have been there. Like one of my friends, uh, my friend Tony, who's in my guild currently, he was in my other guild before and he had a different account in this guild. And then he ended up losing that account and had another account join this guild. And he's had several accounts come in and out of this guild. But either way, he is currently here right now. He's been in there for a while. He's been with my guild for a while with different accounts. My brother was in it before. Then he went AFK. No, and I okay. <laughs> Computer terms. But most of you guys already know that. But either way, pretty much, yeah, he went MIA. So he didn't do that in the game anymore. He quit for a while. When I quit, then we both kind of came back at the same time, and I made the guild. He was in a different guild for a while. Then I told him to come to mine, and he did join. Then I got another one of my friends into it. He joined a while. He had joined a long time ago too, but he gave up on the game pretty early. It was there wasn't too much to learn from it. Then I taught him how everything works now, and now he's in it, and he's been doing a lot better. He's gotten a lot of dragon forged armors, and he's in my guild right now. So that's pretty much all the people that I currently have in my guild, which is not bad it's pretty cool so a lot of people have been there but i've been in this guild since the very beginning i know everything from this guild i i raised this guild i spent the gold to create it and i've worked it all the way up to 56 with all the bonuses and everything i've had help from people coming in and out of it but me personally i've been there since the very beginning i've seen everything go through this guild so this guild is an old guild but it's not done yet I'm going to get this guild max soon enough. It's going to take help from other people, but I will do it. Don't you think I won't? But either way, almost done here. After I finish this one, I think I'm going to be able to get one more level 3 in. So two more attacks, and I will probably be the end of this video. Well, this part of this video, guys. So if I don't get the rest of the footage for you guys, I will record a little more. Just when I have like max energy or something, I will do that for you guys. Record like the four attacks in that, and then end the video there and then once i get the rest of the energy 
I will make um, another part for you. So tomorrow, more likely, I will be getting that 12 energy. So when I do that, I'll get that footage for you guys, and I will probably upload that tomorrow. But the 5 energy will probably be later today. I'll get footage for you guys on that. So I'll be 5, five plus the nine and the 4 that I already have, so a total of 9 energy. So it's not bad. But either way, guys. Uh, yeah, guys. I mean pretty much all I have for this video today well this part of the video like I said don't worry guys it's not over here yet don't think that it's ending I'm gonna keep saying this part of this video this part of the video this and that I'm gonna keep getting it mixed up but this isn't the end here guys so don't worry about that still got more for you guys to come more for you guys to come more to come for you guys there you go so there we go now let me see sorry really quick I'm gonna look outside my window because it started raining earlier I think it stopped now. There's just like a little bit of sprinkling where I'm at, so not bad. Hasn't actually hit hard. It's supposed to rain this weekend, but who knows? We'll see. Ugh. But yeah, again, guys, I'm very happy. I mean, watching this now, I didn't think I'd ever be able to do a level three like this, so pretty happy. One stone. Two stun. But yeah, I think this epic boss, another topic to talk about, this epic boss, I feel like I might be able to hit 200 for the fact that I have these three armors here to help me with the epic boss as well. It's a mono air, so not bad. My fire and earth, I'm currently using two knights, my fire and earth and my air and earth. My air and earth got fairly far with just itself, but I think I got to like 70 something and then he ended up barely losing. Like I lost one time and he needed one more hit. And I'm sure most of you guys have had that somewhere in your Knights and Dragons life where you're so close. Literally one hit and it would have died. And then your knight gets killed and you have to use that extra energy. You're like, really game? Really? You couldn't have stunned? You couldn't have given me that one miss from the, the boss that I was fighting or something just to let me get that one hit? Or my hit couldn't have done a little bit extra damage to have finished it off? Like, really? really game <laughs> so all of us have been there at some point but that happened to me and so i didn't want to end up wasting the energy again so now i'm starting to use two knights and so i think i might be able to get an attack in for you guys so you guys can see that but uh let's see that really quick so as soon as this one finishes so more likely my area fire and earth one's gonna die and my air and earth one's gonna finish it off so let's see Not bad damage. Like I said, I really wish I had that tier 4 pet. Because the tier 3 is great and all. But it sucks just for the fact that it's first ability only shields for one attack. And it shields for a lot. But the other one, like, you see this stun chance? Like, I could be healing all those stuns. Like, but whatever. <laughs> it's the game, am I right? So let's see where I finished at. I'm currently here. So, actually two more attacks and I'll do it. So I'll probably, I'll be back in really quick to get that footage for you guys. But... Let me just go to that the epic boss. So I do have five energy. Let me just get that in really quick and show you guys what I'm talking about. So I'll show you guys exactly where I'm at. I think I did show it at the beginning before the raid started, but it was like really quick. So oh, so I was actually within the 60s. So I was like in the start of the 60s, not even in the 70s yet. But I was somewhere here around like 62 around there, and I barely lost like one hit. Oh, what the heck? I barely lost one hit. I was so mad. I was like, really, game? You couldn't have just given me the extra stun the boss miss something like that no you had to do this to me but whatever i can't complain i have the damage for it so at least i'm able to do that so not bad i'm actually I, I, like i said i might be able to get to 200 we'll see i am currently i believe in the top 100 damage dealers so that's good Ooh, five extra energy let's see yeah i'm in the top 50 currently I think everybody's working on raid right now, so not too many people are going to be focusing on the epic boss. So that's good. That gives me a little bit, little bit of time to push. But all the top 100 players, I'm sure, I'm, are jamming somewhere, unless they have crazy, the you know, like aqueous bounty crazy armors right now. And I, a lot of the paid to play players do. So to them, they're just one knighting it all the way to like 100 and something. I can't do that because none of my rings or amulets are maxed, as you guys can tell. None of them have the stun chance unlocked, so that sucks for me, but what can I do? Oh, wait, what am I doing? Don't fight it. Just, just run. I don't need it anymore. <laughs> I always start a new one because I just like getting rid of it because since I'm doing a lower level fight, it just doesn't give it to me. But um, 
let's open the Dark Prince key just for you guys, it's just just for the fun of it. I'll skip it because there's no point to fusion boost. Not bad. Ooh, I got a two star plus, guys. Oh, I'm so strong now. <laughs> Sarcasm, guys. Sarcasm. Do I get anything out of this? Nope. Nothing. Sadly. What can you do? Let's see, I already opened one. I just got a fusion boost. Uh, I guess for you guys. Let's do a second one. Why not? Let's see if I get anything good. Not like I ever do from a step chest, but. Uh, what did I say? Another fusion boost. But just for you guys, just to try it. So. Yeah, that's the end of this part for you. Video. This is that. That's the end of this video. Not the video. Dang it. See, this is what I'm trying to say it without messing up. But even when I think about it, I say it wrong. That's the end of this part. So I'm going to end the recording here. And I will be back within. Not within an hour. Within two hours with the other footage but I won't be uploading the video right away because I'm gonna be uh, busy at that time so I will get the footage for you guys and then later today I will have that video up for you guys so oh yeah my guild a lot of people keep asking what's my guild this and that if you guys don't know please please watch my videos from the darkness right here F R O M space T H E space D A R K K N E S S from the darkness that's my guild I am the guild master maxi kill and here is my friend code guys WBR VPZ -N -N. I am an Android player and I am from the global server so if you're in EU you guys don't even have Shadow Forged armors first off so you you're probably like why because I have had someone who didn't realize that EU doesn't have Shadow Forged armors but I mean it's kind of obvious and I am Android. Reason is that W. Android always starts with W. iOS starts with X. So remember that, guys. If it's an X in front of your friend code, I am not on the same platform as you. I am on Android platform. You're on iOS. But, yeah, that's my guild name and my friend code. But going to pause the recording here, guys, and I will be back with the rest of the footage for you guys. So, I'll, yeah, I'll be back. All right, guys, so here's the second part for you guys. Um, I just failed right now. I thought I was recording for about a minute and a half, but I wasn't. So, <laughs> yeah, but uh, either way, looking at the uh, length of this video, I think the whole video together might actually be over an hour. So you guys are going to get a really long video. Uh, like I was saying, I said this already <laughs> once, failed the recording, though. But if you guys watch this whole thing, you guys are pretty crazy. I don't know how you guys are going to watch over an hour of Knights and Dragons footage. I'm sure you guys come just for the footage as well, not even for me. Whoever comes to my channel to listen to me talk, you guys just come for the Knights and Dragons, obviously, right? That, that's the reason, right? <laughs> um, but that being said, um, either way, here I am attacking the level 3 again. That's what I did throughout the whole raid. I did attack one level 4 at the very end just to see, and uh, it took me about the exact amount of time that it was taken to take out that boss to take it, so it kind of sucked. But it was pretty cool to take the level 4. Hopefully in the future I can take it a lot easier, but... We'll see. But either way, uh, this boss, I had started it with, like, less than half the health because I had already started attack attacking it. Then I let my energy regen. Then I attacked it here to get the five energy. So that will be a total of nine attacks in this. Well, nine energy. So uh, four bosses, half of another one. Yeah, Nemesis ended up ne messaging me really quick on it. <laughs> so, Nemesis, if you end up watching this again, you already know you did this once before and you did it again i'm probably just gonna have to include you in all my videos man because you second time you've done it so far you're just gonna be a side host for me now <laughs> but uh all, all that being aside like like i said here i got the five la, 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 la. i got the five energy here and i had four already so i'm gonna do a total of nine energies worth of attacks but i use two energy per level three so that's gonna be uh four level threes and half of a level three then i'm gonna get you guys the 12 energy of footage so yeah, let's see if I can commentate through this whole thing. I apologize if I can't, guys. I can't. I, can't. I felt like I said that really weird, but uh, either way, yeah. Um, I probably will be able to. I'll improvise some stuff again. I'm sorry if it's not all knights and dragons related, but it will be a lot of it, and I'll be talking about more or less again me and um. I have to include this in the start of all my videos. This is already going to be late in the video, but this is the start of the second part for me, so it feels like it's early. But I, every time I record a video, I should probably say read the description first because whenever I make videos, I always try to make the description like as straightforward as I can, like what the video is actually about. I don't just use it for random stuff because obviously in my title, I can't include a super long title because if I did, it wouldn't allow me to use it. But uh, either way, 
uh, try to read the description if you guys are ever watching my videos I try to be as straightforward as I can with the description so if like you don't want to watch a certain part of my video or you don't want to watch what the video is about my description will say exactly what it's about and if it's like something you don't want to watch at least you'll know it's there but uh, either way um, I am one four star tier one pet so just one four star in general from getting my tier four four star earth pet so the one I'm using is currently tier three so disappointed i wish i had four the tier four version that would have saved me so much more energy i probably would have been one energy in level three but next time next time and then once i get my rings and amulets max too that's going to be great for me but who knows how long it's going to be till we get another fire and air raid uh water and earth is probably not going to be too bad either there's going to be double elemental with my very last night which is my strongest shadow forge so that's going to be pretty cool but uh either way i mean fire and air is probably the best thing i can go with those three shadow forge because obviously my first knight does the most damage he deals double my second knight takes no additional damage and deals damage and then my third knight again takes no additional damage deals additional damage so when it comes like an air and water raid my my last knight's going to deal double damage not take any additional damage but my second knight's going to deal damage while taking damage and my first knight's going to be taking damage while dealing damage too so kind of sucks but i mean at least i'll be able to use the earth pet during there too and hopefully i have a higher stun chance on everything so then they will be stunning a lot more frequently but we'll see we'll see when the time comes but either way um yeah i did get an ice drop drake berry so i showed that in my other video if you guys watch which this video should have been uploaded before but sadly i took so long i apologize guys but a little bit of things came up and I wasn't the most available so kind of plans change every now and then but I did get this footage for you guys so at least I got that for you guys right but um I did get the, the ice drop drake berry and then I did get the one right after so the dragon key along with the second tier I mean the second yeah second epic pet not tier second epic pet and some gold I believe I think it was like half of a million gold so not bad, not bad. Could have been better, but it's not bad either. Like I said, uh, let me see. My actually, my Shadow Forge has eight hours for it to finish, so I'm actually really happy about that. Fire and water, like I said, so pretty cool. I'm probably gonna max that one as soon as I can because, sorry guys, hiccup. Uh, the upcoming raids are obviously uh, raids and all that are going to be all fire related because this season 7 is all fire elements. So here's fire and air. They're going to have a fire and spirit soon enough, a fire and earth, and fire and water. So pretty cool, pretty cool. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if they're going to have a mono fire though, so that's something else. I, I don't know about that, but oh well. Either way, uh... Yeah, I'm actually pretty happy that I did this. I, I don't know if I'm repeating. Blah, 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 I can't even talk. I don't know if I'm repeating any of this from the first part, so I apologize, guys. Like I said, it's been two days from this audio compared to the other one. So whatever you guys heard, again, I don't don't even remember what I said. But um, uh, yeah, like I said, if I repeat anything, I apologize. But I was so happy during this whole entire raid. I got the farthest I had ever gotten without spending gems. Like I said, I got that second epic pet. So. That's super far for me. I would I was two before that during the last raid. So now that I got that far, I'm actually really happy. And I mean, hopefully this means from now on I can start fighting level threes instead of having to fight level twos. But we'll see, depending on how, if I have the elements or not, obviously. But we'll see, we'll see. As of right now, what I determined is because they're going to, like I said, if the raids go with all the elements, here's fire and air. They're going to have, if they have fire and spirit, I'm going to be able to attack with my two shadow forged uh my three shadow forge obviously this one that's currently attacking so the fire and earth the water and earth and then i'm gonna do double elemental damage with my new fire and water one that's against fire and spirit then when there comes a fire and water one i'm gonna be using the air and earth i'm gonna be using the water and the earth and probably my second water and earth which is not a plus version but we'll see maybe i'll use the fire and water as well it's going to be taking damage but dealing damage as well whereas the air and earth water and earth and another water and earth would be taking no additional damage and i can use all earth so i probably will i'll probably do that because then that way i can use my tier 4 rock pet but we'll see uh, i'm trying to make most of it because i want to use that rock pet but uh air and water like i said oh no not air and water they're not going to have that so fire and air we said fire and spirit we said and then fire and water we said so fire and earth fire and earth um I'm going to be using my water earth, water earth, fire water more than likely, but I need a pet for that though, sadly. So I don't have a pet. So I'm probably going to be fighting level twos, not even level threes during that raid. 
Uh, yeah, so we'll see. Uh, sorry for the delay here, guys. I was kind of preoccupied when I was recording this. Like I said, I was hanging out with a couple of friends, and there's going to be a slight delay here, and I for totally forgot to edit this part out. I knew there was a part I needed to edit, but it wasn't a really long delay, so whatever. But um, here we are going back into it. But uh, that's more or less what I have in mind for the upcoming raids, because like I said, this entire Season 7 is fire-based armors and so that means if I have raid bosses coming up are going to be fire based raid bosses let me see if I can actually see if they have it um I think the next raid that comes up is going to probably be the fire and earth one because based off of the schedule they have if you guys watched my other video and you've seen it in your news feed already they have an amulet there that looks like it's going to be the the one that I'm using here the volcanus inducia the eternal version so the volcanus in volcanus eternal which looked like it was going to be fire and earth, and I'm fairly certain it's going to be fire and earth, but we'll see. But uh, either way, uh, I think that's going to be the next raid, so I'm probably going to want to prepare for that. So get my water, earth, water, earth, fire, water. But like I said, I need to see what pet I'm going to even use for it, man. I'm not even... I don't even know. Because I do have the water one... And I want to use that, but I have a tier 3 water one, but at the same time, I'm not maxing it because I'm going to use that for fodder for my tier 4 earth pet. Maybe I can get enough. Let me see. I have two epic ones right now. I might be able to evolve my water epic pet, but we'll have to wait and see about that. My goodness, this is so complicated. Oh, but I did pass uh, stage 100 on the epic boss, that being a side note, so that's pretty cool. Here, I don't know why my game took a, a little while to load. Like I said, not sure why, but uh, okay, there we go. Now we're going into the next part of the attack. Um, I guess let me just throw that out there. Throw throw that out there. Throw this out here. Um, like I said, uh, in a lot of my previous videos, I can't really make Night and Dragons content for you guys every day. I would like to. I know that's where most of my subscribers come from and what they want to watch. And like I said, I would be so so happy to make it for you guys. But with one basic account that I'm mainly using, it's not easy for me to make, make content on it. Because my second and third account, I use those, like I said, mainly for scouting and raids and you know finishing off raid bosses and stuff like that. So I don't really go for saving gems on those accounts. So um not gonna beg anyone not gonna you know force you guys i'm just gonna throw it out there i'm not gonna even ask you guys but if you guys want to offer uh leave a comment uh i'll try to get some info out on my page so like some channel information for you guys to see where you guys can contact me at uh i'll be i'll probably put something up for you guys but um if you guys have accounts that you have lots of gems and you're willing to open you're planning to open chests or something you have like i said a lot of gems and you want to open a chest and you want me to make a video on that just send me an email like if i have my email on the channel info already but if i don't uh leave a comment and i will try to message you or something and i'll give you information and if you guys want me to make a video with your account that'd be awesome because then you guys are allowing me to make more content for my account first off and then secondly i will throw a shout out there for you and if you want people to add you i will uh totally be on honored to do that uh right here i do go into a raid attack so this is technically the middle part because I did a recording for the very first, then this part, then the third part. So, But the third and the second here are already combined, so that's why I'm doing all this commentary with that. So I'm just farming here to get the raid boss. I mean raid boss, uh, epic boss, and then I'm going to attack him really quick. Just do one attack, and then we're going into the third part. So right here, what was I on? Like 90-something, 70-something? I don't even know. I think I was on the 90s already. Like I said, I currently just completed stage 100. Let me see. Yeah, I'm on 101 right now. So this is the farthest I've ever gotten in a raid and epic boss. So that's pretty cool. But uh, either way, back to the topic. Like I said, if you guys have an account, you want me to open chests on, like you're willing to let me use the account, feel free to message me. Dang, so I was actually really far behind. That was like 70 or 80 something. I don't know. But um, feel free to message me. Uh, I will get back as soon as possible. Usually I reply immediately if I can. If I don't, for all my other commentators, commentators, for my other pe other subscribers who comment on my videos, I apologize. It's just, like I said, usually things come up and I see your comments. Don't think I don't see them. It's just sometimes I have other things to do and I can't reply immediately to those kind of comments. Whereas if it's something that important, you know, you guys, like I even gave my line info before. Uh, if you guys want to add me online, my name is Maxi Kill without the one, just like my YouTube channel. 
but it's without the one like i said uh message me there and if you guys want me to you know use your account for a video that'd be totally awesome can open gems for you guys if you have a if you pushed in a top 10 want me to do leveling of that armor awesome as well but if not i mean chess videos that that'd probably be something you guys would be interested in as well and i mean who knows maybe if you if i do it for you it'd be a little bit more interesting but at the same time you'd probably be a little worried because if you don't get anything then i mean you guys can blame me so yeah but it's just, it just if you guys are willing to help like i said i'm not going to force anyone to do it i'm not going to be asking or begging or anything like that it's if you guys feel like you trust me because i don't want to take advantage of anyone i'm not trying to break people's trust here i'm trying to earn trust so that's what the point of this little part is but that's just the topic right there so like i said i'll try to update my info and see if i can get something for you guys some information for you guys can contact so you guys can contact me on but um that being said, so this part right here is currently the third part, I believe, after this one attack here. If not this attack or the whole epic, I mean, whole, whole raid boss, then I will be uh, getting the energy. So let's see right here if, when I die. Hold on. Sorry, I was just opening a Dark Prince chest right now. I had 10 keys. Didn't really get anything, sadly. So yeah, not here. It's right after I finish the epic boss, the epic boss, raid boss. I keep mixing them up. Right after I finish the raid boss off, then you'll see I get the 12 energy. So this is the part that really makes it long. If not, I would have probably already been done with the video. But like I said, I told you guys I'd get this content out there for you guys. And that's what I'm doing right now. My goodness, I'm crazy, aren't I? Sometimes, sometimes. But... Trying to make the best of the content for you guys. It's just leveling up my ring and amulet for my Titan's Yield Mail Plus. That armor still has a long way to go before it's maxed. Sadly, I think my stats are going to probably be close to 10k on attack. 7k on defense and over a thousand health. So that's cool. Plus the stun chance. So I'm really excited for that. But um... Either way, so here we are, about to finish off this level 3. Let's see, let's see. And then, like I said, I'm fairly certain I get the 12 energy here, so... Okay, finish it off, and... Yep, there you go, 12 energy. Not bad, not bad. How many dragon... I mean, dragon coins... How many uh, silver coins do I have? Because I did collect, like, one or two during that. Uh, I have four. Four! Yeah, still have a long way to go. Let me actually level up my Clepsidra just to one. Oh, it's already leveled up. What am I thinking? Wait, why does my Clepsidra not look? I'm sorry, guys. I'm a little distracted just trying to see why this one doesn't look like this one. Exit without changes. <sighs> both look exactly the same because i know when you like ascend the armor it's supposed to look slightly different but these look exactly the same. i don't know i'm not gonna get stuck on that so that being that oh no i think it's when you hit level 99 right i don't know i'm sorry if you guys heard noise right now again i'm moving my mic my headset i need to get a microphone soon enough but hopefully if you guys keep watching my videos um i hope to earn a decent amount of money with this channel to start buying items for you guys don't think i'm just gonna be spending the money just on myself i'm not i'm not gonna try to do that first up i want to first up first off i want to upgrade you know my setup and everything so like i said get a microphone maybe get a good recording camera or something because if as of right now i don't even have a setup for face cam which is going to take a while for me to get set up luckily you guys aren't getting me to 500 subscribers just yet i think i got some time till that happens but um i need to get a good face cam something to record me because if not i'm gonna need my phone and my phone i don't think is the best quality so yeah that's gonna take a while but like i said i want to get a good microphone because obviously you guys are always hearing clicking and this and that and sometimes you guys hear background noises there or just little noises that i make and i'm sure it bugs you guys some of you guys not all you guys but either way i want to make it a little bit better so i'm planning to probably get a microphone when i get the money for it so we'll see about that um my goodness we still have 20 minutes to go guys oh i already did this one time where i made an entire commentary and now to do it again well i'm doing this 
oh, um, actually, now that I think about it, because I just looked at line, I was looking at my alliance talking. Uh, where'd you guys finish at? Let me know in the comments down below. Uh, obviously, if you guys are, you know, good pay-to-play players, you guys are going to be over there probably finishing off all the milestones, because I know a couple of my, uh, friends and my, well, my alliance members, they were, uh, finishing off the rewards, some were finishing close to me, some were finishing a little bit ahead, some were finishing a little bit behind, but, uh, how did you guys do? Did you guys get all the milestones? Did you get the milestones you guys wanted? Did you beat a new, set a new personal record? Were you behind what you usually get? Like, what happened? Let me know, because, you know, it's pretty interesting to see what you guys say, too. And I'm, I'm ready to, as I'm saying this, I'm already predicting. I'm going to be reading a bunch of comments. Oh, you know, I was hitting, like, uh, what, 200 million, something like that. Obviously, all you pay-to-play pay, pay to play players. And, I mean, that's totally fine. I'm not hating, like I said. But uh, most of my commenters that I've had before, you know, previously were saying that. So... <laughs> I'm ready to hear that again. Sorry if you guys hear a bunch of background noise. I'm just doing stuff currently while the recording's going on as well. So, oh my god, I just blinded myself. Um, I do have a Samsung VR, so who knows? Maybe you guys are ever interested in that. I might make uh, some footage for you guys on that. Get some VR gameplay. We'll see, we'll see. But uh, either way, Knights and Dragons is first right here. So, yeah, that. Uh, either way, like I said, let me know how you guys did. Again, like I said, I'm more likely uh, predicting. I'm going to be reading the comments of 100 mil, 200 mil, 500 mil, maybe. I don't even know what was the highest scoring person, honestly. Let me check right now. What was the highest scoring individual player? Leaderboards, uh, top players, Loke City EX. 674 million congratulations to you just getting a bunch of more shot oh my god wow i'm sorry guys i just wow i was just looking at it if you guys did not notice take the time for all of you guys who are free to play and maybe even some of you pay to play players as well if you haven't seen it yet but i'm sure most of you pay to play have Go to the leaderboards. Look at Loke City. He's the number one individual player. Go through his armors. His armors are practically all over 10,000 in attack. There's only one that isn't, and that's because he doesn't have the right rings and amulets on. Or I honestly don't know because he has that same... Oh, no, it's because he doesn't have the armor maxed. Yeah, I'm sure he has a plus version and he's working on it. Because he has a regular one, which is 11,000 attack. And then he has that same armor, but it's not leveled up. And it's 8,000 attack. So who knows, maybe he's getting him ready. But either way, he's ready. He is prepared for that fire and spirit raid. I'm so jealous. 10,021 attack. 11,185. 10,236. So he has the aqueous bounty over 10,000 the uh, or orsini thunder or orsini or thunder axe the f air and earth one from the b shank season he has that one ten thousand and then he has the corinthian steam plate i believe it is the one that came with the brio orbs he has that one at eleven thousand so yeah <laughs> oh my god i can't believe this man like wow this is why free to play players are just so annoyed at the game because we we go in look at me i mean i'm gonna use myself as an example i thought i was doing good in the game now but then i look at my stats i'm at 8,000 attack with my main knight 6,000 defense that's with ring and amulets not max but still 900 health and i can barely do a level three <laughs> and then i see players like that 11,000 attack, 7,000 defense, 900 health, completely maxed. Oh my god. <sighs> <sighs> that being said, <laughs> just forget I'm talking about that, guys. For all you free to play players, I'm not trying to make you saltier than when you already are, because if you're like me, you're probably saltier already at this game. But at the same time, we keep playing it, so it's kind of our fault for being salty, right? But, um, yeah, <laughs> I can't believe it. Oh, my God, just looking at that. Wow. But, uh, like I was saying earlier, I'm sure most of you guys probably already 
commented if you wanted to uh, how much you did in the raid what milestone you hit if you collected all the milestones if you beat your record or not because like i said to me this was the farthest i've ever done in a raid like the most damage i've ever done i did uh what 30 million let me see let me see let me see my guild yeah i did 31 million attack 31 and a half so 31 million five hundred twenty four thousand not bad not bad my second highest person in my guild was my brother at almost six mil so he's actually pretty happy too he's improving as well so that's good that's good um but yeah all you other pay-to-play players i mean damn i am nowhere near you guys but either way that's my highest 31 mil uh never got to the second epic pet so that's cool that's my newest uh high that's my highest milestone now so that's my current record and level threes is my current record of what i fought so far in raids and this was this one i was taking out in two energy so that's pretty cool let's see if in the future i can one energy them but i'm gonna have to wait and see oh let me actually check something i want to see if where's the first tier four pet wow so for blitz no tier four pets sadly <laughs> Well, that sucks. I just want more team, one more tier 4 pet. But I guess I'm going to have to wait on that. <laughs> what can you do, right? Alright, so... 12 more minutes, guys. 8 more energy. And this video will be over. <sighs> I'm sorry if I've gotten really annoying, guys. Just talking about topic here, topic there, topic there. I've been grabbing things from thin air. Sometimes I stay quiet. I'm sure most of you guys probably are okay with it just for the fact that you know how difficult it is to commentate for so long without having a, you know, solid topic to talk about. But at the same time, I, I want the best quality content for you guys. And so even if you guys are happy with what I do, sometimes I'm just like, I feel like I'm not doing the best for you guys. I, I need to improve. But you can only get so far with just doing what you do, right? So either way... um. Oh, actually, let me know some another topic. Uh, one of my friends, well, my one of my closer friends, he's in my guild too. Uh, he just apparently recent recently started watching videos too. It was actually yesterday or the day before when we were playing uh Knights and Dragons. He ended up was uh watching. He ended up getting the video offers finally after I don't know how long. So, let me know on that too. Have you guys ever had? Oh, well, I'm sure everybody has, but recently were you guys getting video offer problems? Because me, I've been good so far lately. Like every night I watch videos and I can always get it to where I will make the video offer button gray out. So I actually like legit watch all the videos that I can for that day. But uh, let me know if you guys are having problems recently because he for like a month did not watch any videos. So he was kind of mad. And then finally on Friday, uh, he ended up getting video offers. So he was happy about that. Let me know if you guys got any recently, like if it started working and if you had problems first off. Because like I said, he had problems. So I guess now it's actually working. I don't know. I need to talk to him again and see if it's working still. But either way, uh, dang, man. 11 million i can't believe i was able to hit 31 mil and i was barely at 11 million there but that was like what was it yeah that was literally at the night of the first day if not it was really early in the morning because i think i might have done it like one or two in the morning because i did stay up pretty late with my friend so that's why i didn't get the footage out for you guys immediately i apologize but i got all this footage fairly quickly but like i said it was decent gaps in between and then i had my friends end up spending the night at my house so we were up all night and then the day after um they didn't i was helping with a yard sale that my family was having and so my friends stayed for a while too they were helping that out then i had to help put everything away and then today or yeah today because i still have 10 minutes till midnight so today i went out i watched um the new resident evil movie resident evil the final chapter and then i went out to eat and if you guys are curious i am a pretty decent resident evil fan not the not the games themselves i wish i had gotten into the games but the movies i've seen every single movie and so that's why i wanted to watch this movie to finish off the series finally 
because the series needs to just end. But it was actually a really good movie. I did enjoy it, but at the same time, watching that ending, I honestly don't know if the series is over or not. I feel like it is, but at the same time, I feel like it might not be because you know how most companies are. They're just going to milk stuff out of it, but whatever, whatever. That's that's another topic, but uh, who knows? Let me see. I'm trying to think because for the future, I, I have things in store. Uh, actually, for that PvP stuff, I'll talk about it when the time gets up. But uh, either way, I, I still need to work on everything. Like I said, I need to get all my setups set. But in the future, I am going to try to uh, live stream for you guys once I get more subscribers and I figure out how to do everything, obviously, because I'm still kind of a noob to things. <gasps> who said that? <laughs> but no, I know it. Uh, I'm not the best editor. I'm not the best commentator i'm not the best player i'm not the black ble ble blessed i'm not the best of anything i'm just someone who does stuff and i enjoy doing it and so once i improve i will work on that because i mean first off i need to freaking work on getting my own thumbnails out because i mean the most of them are my own but they're not really edited if you guys noticed uh the one that i made for the like epic boss bug that it was the recent one before the one i just uploaded that thumbnail i did edit myself that was all the screenshots i got and stuff like that but as you can tell it's really not not a creative thumbnail but most of the time who cares about the thumbnail right i'm not trying to clickbait you guys so don't worry about that but either way um I need to work on a lot of stuff. I am not the best editor at all. But either way, like I said, in the future, I am going to work on live streaming for you guys. So who knows, maybe in the future when a big raid comes by, uh, I'm probably going to live stream for you guys so we can get a lot of footage out there. And when I do end up deciding to live stream, I'll probably end up taking questions and stuff like that. So that will probably be like a Q&A raid live stream, something like that. We'll see, but either way, um, that's for the future. Just a heads up for you guys, so hopefully in the future I have a lot more people willing to talk to me. Then that'll be cool, because I know I do get a decent amount of views on my videos, but it's always at uh, different intervals of my career. And that sounds funny, but uh, honestly, though, like different times. Like, I can upload one video in one day, and I'll probably get like 100 views and the next day i won't get any views and then like a week later it will just be at like 400 views and i'm like what the heck and i don't even have that many subscribers so i'm actually really happy that a lot of people watch my videos but it's not for all my videos first off and then secondly i it's just i don't know why there's a big gap in between but either way i don't think it will be if i live stream right now i will have a lot of viewers it will be probably like 50 viewers if i get lucky during the live stream and then the rest will just watch it after whatever so i won't be getting a lot of questions so that's why i want to wait till the future for you guys to do a live stream with a q a and things like that and that will probably be it during the time too once i get a face cam so then you guys can actually see me while i'm doing the live stream instead of just having content out there for you guys because that'd probably be a little awkward but uh either way future plans future plans <laughs> still got a lot of things ahead of me to do i still have things in my life that i need to do as well i'm still gonna be very busy but i still take the time out of my day to get content for you guys so if you guys really are watching this to watch me i i'm very pleased and i hope you guys are happy too because when i was doing what was it i think the other raid two weekends ago I was working as I was getting footage. It was just, it was hectic, but I did it for you guys. I wanted to get that content out for you guys. So it was crazy, but like I said, I do it for you guys, not just myself. So hopefully by that time, a lot more people will want to see a live stream. So we'll work on that. We'll work on that. But sorry if I repeat myself. I notice as I say it too that I'm like, why am I repeating? But it's who I am. <laughs> What can you do? Well, this video is getting close to an end, guys. And <sighs> Sorry about the yawn, guys. And sorry if that was really loud. I just noticed my microphone, like, the, the recorder itself expanded so far. Because that one moment was loud. I apologize. <laughs> but, yeah, I, like I said, today, which is five minutes till it's over, I was out for 
a good amount of time and when I got home I was just exhausted I didn't even want to do this editing but I guaranteed I mean I guaranteed I promised you guys that I would do it and I'm gonna have it uploading before the day ends but it's not gonna be uploaded till the till, till Monday so my apologies guys I, I 50% lied 50% not lied so either way it is gonna finally be out there for you guys so yeah but Right after this is done editing and it's uploaded, I am knocking out. I am tired. But in a few hours, we will be starting the Blitz. So I will be getting that ready. And then... Sorry, I had something on my screen. On my phone screen, I was taking that off. And then, uh, who knows? We'll see. What other footage can I get for you guys? Apparently, like I said, on Tuesday. Let me see. So, it's supposed to be on the 7th, which is Tuesday coming up. So, two days from now, a day from four minutes from now, because it's going to be Monday and four minutes for me. In a day, there's apparently going to be another heroic, if the calendar's saying that. Because I don't know. Like I said, it said the 7th. It starts the 7th, and it starts the 21st. So... That was kind of confusing, but let's see, guys. A day. We're going to find out exactly what that meant. If Heroic does start on the 7th or it's something else that has to do with Heroic. I, I have no idea. And then on Wednesday, I will get some footage for you guys about the new Epic Boss coming out. I mean, most of you guys are going to know that. And then any other news that comes out. But we'll have that footage just so I can get some footage for you guys. And then Thursday is the day that's going to matter. Because that PvP apparently is coming out on Thursday. So we need to see what that is. Soon as I get out, I will try to be the first person out there with content for you guys. But knowing me, I'm either going to be busy or I am just not going to be the first person. And what can you do, right? But I'm going to try to be. Try to be is keyword. And that's what matters is that I'm trying, right? I hope it matters because if it doesn't, then why am I here? Why am I talking to you guys? Why am I doing this? You guys don't even care. <gasps> I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm doing this, guys. I'm a weirdo. My friends tell me all the time, and I know it, but at the same time, I think it's good to be weird, because why do you want to be normal? Why do you want to be normal in a world like this? It's always better to be weird, but don't be too weird to the point where no one likes you, because then you're just that weird. But be weird with people who can be weird with you, if you are going to be weird. But uh, this video is coming close to an end, guys, so I guess I'm going to have to start wrapping it up here. Somehow I ended up commentating throughout this whole thing, so yeah but uh again let me do my last minute apologies because literally there's a minute left uh apologies for any weird noises you guys might have heard i was grabbing things here and there i didn't want to keep myself bored apologies for repeating things and apologies for the bad contents you know i'm sure it's not really good quality but i tried but that being said let me know guys like everything I asked for. Let me know how you did on the raid. Let me know how let me know how you guys are doing throughout the game. Are you guys paying to go through the game or are you guys free to play? Or are you guys mostly free to play like me? Were you free with all your armors and stuff like that? But if it comes down to ringing amulets, you kinda you get tempted and you just have to spend. Let me know guys, but either way, video's coming to an end, twenty seconds, so if you guys enjoyed this entire video and you sat through it all, you're crazy first off. But secondly, like the video if you guys like it. Subscribe if you want to see more. And right after this ends, I'll talk to you guys in the next video. So, take care, guys. Till next time.